If you want a way to gather ideas from your employees, then Teams can help you out. There's a pre-built power app that you can just add to any Teams channel and it'll help you gather some ideas without you doing any extra setup or work. We've got new videos on Microsoft 365 and Microsoft Teams coming out every Tuesday. So remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to get notified every time a new video comes out. I'm Gavin Jones. I used to work for a Fortune 500 company and now help some of the biggest brands in food and drink save time for their employees and make their employees' lives easier. If you need help doing the same thing, I've got a few different ways I can help you out. Stick around to the end to find out details about how we could work together. So come into a Teams channel that you want to add it to click and there's a tab go to employee ideas if you don't see it just start typing employee and it'll pop up click employee ideas it says add this app to your channel click save so we'll click save i've already got one added which is why it's come up with employee ideas one but yours will just say employee ideas and you can still change the name of that tab by clicking the down arrow and clicking V name. It takes a while because it needs to install that app so you can see the little progress bar at the bottom as it'll go through and update it. And because it's built on the Power platform, you can edit that app. If you know what you're doing, you can just go into the Power Apps web app and just change anything you want about that app. But don't worry, you don't need to do that. You can do a bit of customization on the app itself. And we'll take a look at how employees can submit ideas and get things through to management. So it pre-populates those for you, but you do have the ability to change it if you wanted to. And then we'll say, let's go. And then clearly there's some it's there already pre-populated. It's saying oh, I've got 14 ideas. It's the only the first time we've uh, added this in. So we've got weekly top ideas with bike to work. There's an idea for that. And you can see here, then I can see all of the campaigns um, that have, uh, have come up where you can have like campaigns of ideas. So you can ask for ideas about uh, returning to the workplace in this example, um, questions this week, um, some ideas about in-person meetings potentially and then people can add ideas if the campaign's not expired, and then people can upvote them if they think it's a good idea, and then you can go through and see which ones are the best. So all these campaigns have expired, so if I just go and change these to um, July 2022, say, and save, then that'll say how many days left are in that campaign and how many days you want to collect ideas, and then any person could come in and submit an idea. This is just the admin that sees these manage campaigns section, I believe, although again, you can change that in the app settings. So once the campaign's active, you'll see a little preview on the front page of this, and this is what the user would see as they come in. Click on that, and then here's where they can submit their own idea if their one doesn't appear. Again, this one's saying what impact will have, how many employees will be infected, and how much effort it will take to implement. You can go through into Power Apps and just get rid of all that if you want. You can just have a title and a description um, or something like that. You can share it to the channel when you submit the idea and then that idea will appear in the list of ideas. And if you like any other ideas, you can go and give them a like and obviously anybody in the company can go do that and upvote your ideas for you. If you need more help being productive at work and your organization isn't supporting you, then go and check out metime.thinkific.com. We've got some courses on personal productivity and Microsoft Teams Essentials at the moment. If you use the code SOCIAL20 to buy the courses before they are launched, then you will get a 20% off discount added at checkout. And there's just 20 codes to use before they run out. So if you're interested, then go and have a look quickly.